makers of Shaq Fu. <laughs> it's out of this world here for Super Nintendo. Let's see if it can live up to the Shaq Fu legacy. Okay. It's one of the few Super Nintendo games I know that has a loan screen, but I don't know. It's not too bad. There we go. And you got to press up right away. <laughs> I'll help you through the first level at least. Okay. And that's your jump. <laughs> yep. So this is like Prince of Persia or Lesser Day Unlikely, where the jumps are a bit more realistic than your typical Super Mario style action games. Okay. Oh, look at the cute little snails. Let's go pet him. <laughs> okay, let's kick his ass in. What? I'm dead? <laughs> get used to that. Yeah, if those tentacles get you, it's a game over. So what do you gotta do? You gotta kick these ones. Yeah! Eat it! Okay. Yeah, what I like about this game is, yeah, even though this game was released out in 1992, yeah, that was one year before Star Fox hit the scene. And yeah, this game actually uses some very advanced polygon graphics. Very unique art style. Oh shit. Oh yeah! <laughs> to run, you had to hold down the Y button. Just like Super Mario. Uh, online Super Mario? Oh. <laughs> yeah, you got no massive mushroom. Shit! <laughs> okay, so you think you're pretty much screwed. So how do you beat this part? Especially since this beast pretty much has the upper hand on you. And, yeah. We get saved. Are you gonna say anything? Ah, oh, shit. It's game over. Oh, no, wait. I'm still alive. Yeah, amazingly enough, this game is done in real time. Okay, hurry up. Man, that's just so amazing for 1992. I never seen anything like this. Oh yeah. And I just love the way this game plays out like a movie. It's your typical 2D platformer, but it has more story elements to it as well. Alright, so this is what you're supposed to do. Yeah. There we go. Make a shield. Yeah, so you have to hold down the button and make the shield. And it helps this guy escape from it. Easier said than done. <laughs> okay. Oh, crap. Okay, move. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm back here again. <sighs> it's a fun game. Just get ready to die a lot, unless you know the level layout top to bottom. There we go. Kill that a-hole. <laughs> it has a password system, so if you know the simple four-digit code, you can go back to it anytime. Yeah, the cinemas are pretty basic right now, but holy shit. This looked very impressive for the 1990s at least. 
<laughs> yep. And he's driving a Ferrari. Is that actually licensed? I don't know. <laughs> Everything down to the music, the stylized artwork, the great controls, and the puzzle-like gameplay. Everything about how this world is done pretty well. If you're expecting a high octane action game, you're not going to get it here. <laughs> if you would like a little bit of problem solving in your video games, you'll definitely like this. Oh, this world here for Super Nintendo, it earns an 84 out of 100. Definitely one to track down. <laughs> You'll get a blast out of it. 